I'm gonna have to warm my horse up a little bit because he'll try to buck me off. Don't stab me with the needle, please. Guess I can say goodbye to next year's Christmas bonus. <laughs> Shot. We're going to rope him to that. All right, let's just go see if this uh, if this calf will just let us rope him right where he is, and we'll just lay him down. If I got to run him down, I'm going to have to warm my horse up a little bit because he'll try to buck me off. And that'll be a great video and Lily would love to see it, but okay, so we got this calf out here. We need to, he's Jamie's, but we need to get him doctored. He's feeling pretty poorly this morning. I don't know. He's got an ulcer in his left eye and you know, he's just shabby looking. I don't know. So we'll give him, you got all the medicine there. We'll just, I'll rope him and you doctor him. All right. All right. Lily barely walks though. She oh. like, she walks in slow motion. What are you talking about? Oh, nothing. Every day. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Whenever you have employees, you become really hyper conscious of how they do everything. Guess I can say goodbye to next year's Christmas bonus. <laughs> Okay, Lily, let's tie them down. You gotta be careful with these cattle with horns because they like to slam their head up and down. So always come right in behind them right here and put your foot right there so they can't get you. All right, so he can't get loose from that. Maybe. You just stick it in there, don't you? Well, more or less. I mean, you only want to put it under the skin. You don't want to get it in the muscle. So get your syringe out there. Okay, pull the cap off. There you go. Don't stab me with the needle, please. And then pull this skin up and you just stick it in and under the skin. Remember, you'll kind of feel it sort of yeah. pop in there. Do you there, just press you know? this part? Or no, what? you squeeze the trigger. like. Okay. Yep. So you want to give it about right here. So there's a triangle. You see this triangle right here? Mm -hmm. That's called the injection triangle. And you want to pull the skin up and get it to where it's under the skin. Okay? Yep. Yeah. Put push it till it sort of pops. Did you get it in there? Pull it back a little bit. Yeah, you're in there. Okay. So pump it. Uh let's see. Do three times. Pump it three times. Yeah, full. Click. All the way. Three, there you go. Now find you a new spot. Oh, you're shooting it out the other side. Okay, so you shot it all the way through part of it. So you just got to get it in, under the skin. Go ahead. Go down. Oh, I'm sorry. Go down more than more than in. Down. There you go. Like that. Yeah. P pull the skin up. Pull it up. There you go. Now stick it in there. <clears throat> Hold this. Now squeeze it. You can't be timid. You got to get it on in there. There you go. That's it. Okay. This is called a ball and gun, and this is called a bolus. Okay. It's just a big pill, right? Don't look so worried. 
okay so you're gonna kind of grab him stick your fingers in his mouth on this side and pull his head up I'll hold his head up for you and then you just stick this in and you want it to go all the way down see how deep that is mm -hmm. that's why the ball and gun so long stick stick another one in there we're gonna give him two and a half of these he's missing a tooth right there Like yeah, he's missing mm -hmm. an adult too. Yep, there you go. There you go. That'd be good. As long as it sticks, you, know, you don't want it to fall out. Go from the side. From the side. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Push it all the way in there. All the way, all the way, all the way. There you go. Now, good. Good job. All right. Okay. Here we go. Go ahead, buddy. He'll get up. Good work, Lily. You're like a vet now. Oh yeah. You saved a cow's life. I mean, that's hey, that's saying something. All right. Or you killed him. We're not sure yet. Yeah, we're not sure yet. <laughs> Don't stick yourself with that needle there. Hi, this is Richard Boatwright. If you like what you've seen here, then you might consider becoming a member of B1 Horsemanship. You can sign up at b1horsemanship.com.